hi guys welcome back to WizBlock. today we'll be continuing our computer networking tutorials now um we're looking at network topologies today a topology is the physical or logical layout of a network now there are five main network topologies the first one we'll be looking at is or star now or star topology how this works is that all devices on all devices or nodes on the network are connected to a central device called a hub or in this case a switch now if a machine whenever a machine is sending information that information is sent to the central device the switch and the switch broadcasts the information to out all other ports except the port that it received the information on what that means is that if this machine is if this machine this machine is sending information to this machine then it's sending information to the hub the hub broadcasts in the information out all the ports except the port that you received the information from see that information was not intended for this machine or this machine these machines will discard the information and machine 2 will, will accept and do whatever it wants with the information our second topology is our bus topology now with the bus topology all the devices oops sorry about that now with the bus topology all the devices all the nodes on the network are connected to a backbone this is the backbone this is the backbone um the backbone has something on it called terminators the terminators really cut transmission they prevent transmission from going any further this way or this way because how the bus works is that when a machine uh, transmit information on the, the backbone the information is sent right along the backbone each machine each node checks that information to see if it's actually addressed to them if it's not addressed to them they just leave it alone um whichever information whichever node destination node that whichever node destination node that the information is intended for that node will take off the information from the backbone now if for some reason the node the desk the node that the information is intended for is not on the network for some strange reason then the information will travel right along the backbone until it hits a terminator and the information is just discarded and that's the purpose of the terminators uh, our other topology is our ring now with the ring Each device is each device on the network, each node on the network requires a special permission card called a token before they can send information. If a node does not have the token, it cannot send information on the ring network. So seeing that this machine has their token, then it can transmit whatever information it has to whichever um machine on the network after the machine that it has, it has transmitted the information to receive the network it would the machine the sending machine will just discard the token and the token would float around the network until another node on the network picks up the token and picks up the token in order to transmit its information so the in the ring topology nodes can only 
transmit information on the network when they have the permission card or the token other network I'll be looking at is the mesh topology now the mesh topology is really nodes that are connected via redundant links I think that's pretty self-explanatory but um, each node has several routes or links connecting it to other nodes on the network so in case one node goes down then the there are several other backup links and last but not least we have a hybrid topology known as the tree now the tree is comprised of a bus topology a bus topology see devices connected to the bus and a tree and a star I'm sorry a star so this is a central device or the mm -hmm. hub and each device is connected to it to the central device that's how you know that it's a star once the nodes are connected to a central device it's a star and that star is connected to the backbone and you know that devices that are connected to a backbone they are you know that topology is known as a bus yes and that's it guys tree mesh the real disadvantage that with the star is that if the if the central device goes down let's say if the hub goes down then the network will fail because the hub is really what keeps the network in place it allows the information to transmit from sender to receiver uh, this is the same thing with the bus topology if the backbone breaks then the entire network goes down same thing with the ring if one node on the ring goes down then it can hamper this transmission of information let's say this machine needed to send information to this machine machine B needs to send information to machine A then because this machine went down uh, the machine A could would not get the information a go around a work around is sometimes it build what is known as a double linked ring so you have one ring going this way and the other going in the opposite direction so if this when this machine goes down our machine B would have to do is activate the backup link which is this and just transmit the information through this node and then to its destination there's no real disadvantage to the mesh only thing is that the redundant there are a lot of redundant links which means a lot of cabling which means a lot of um expense so yeah and the tree would have the same disadvantage as the bus and the star with the bus if this if this the backbone breaks then the network then the tree breaks down essentially so that's it for network topologies guys um stay tuned we'll be looking at the osi model in our next tutorial. Bye.